Another gold rush town was Marble Bar, established over 100 years ago. The town was named after this deposit, which was thought to be marble. However, it turned out to be Jasper. Marble Bar's population swelled to 5,000, and these wonderful government buildings were built using local stone. Marble Bar won the dubious title of Australia's hottest town in 1924, when the temperature soared to more than 37.8 degrees Celsius, or 100 degrees Fahrenheit, for 161 consecutive days. That's some heat wave. The pioneers were tough, and it took more than heat and dust to beat them. Digging was by pick and shovel, dynamite and wheelbarrow. Unfortunately, the gold in Marble Bar fizzled out and prospectors left the town in droves. The only significant remnant of the town's gold mining past is the Comet Gold Mine. Today it's a museum and tourist centre, a few kilometres from Marble Bar Pool. Today, conditions in Marble Bar are much more comfortable. The school, offices, shops and homes are air-conditioned. The heat doesn't seem to concern at least one group in town. These children love to play in the park. When you visit Marble Bar, you simply have to have a drink in the town's famous ironclad hotel. A good example of the creative use of available resources by our pioneers. Another resource is the sun, and hybrid solar farms in Marble Bar and Nullagine have solar panels which track the sun throughout the day. These solar farms are the largest of their type in Australia and supply 65% of daytime energy needs.